Tonight, hundreds of marchers are calling on Florida lawmakers to repeal Florida's Stand Your Ground law. They joined Reverend Al Sharpton and the parents of Trayvon Martin and Jordan Davis at the Capitol today. The deaths of their sons bringing the Stand Your Ground law into national spotlight. Good evening. I'm Abby Maurer. And I'm Rockman Johnson. You're inside the news at 5. Now, people from around the country were calling for a change to the law. The rally kicked off just after 9.30 with a march from the Civic Center over to the Capitol. Christina Resnack was at the rally all day, and as the leaders spoke, uh, there were so many different things that were going on. Christina's joining us right now in the newsroom live. And Christina, uh, Congresswoman Kareem Brown, who we just heard from moments ago, was there, Reverend Al Sharpton. What were some of the things that they were talking about as it related to Stand Your Ground? Well, Rockman, in addition to those two, the parents of Trayvon Martin and Jordan Davis were there, as well as the families of Kendrick Johnson and Emmett Till. And as you can imagine, their son's deaths made today's rally much more personal for everyone who attended. <laughs> Chants of no justice, no peace echo in downtown Tallahassee. Thousands gather in front of the Florida Capitol rallying for changes to the state's standard ground law. Local Representative Alan Williams proposed a set of bills to repeal the law in last year's legislative session, but the bills failed. This year, he's trying again. We must not allow their deaths and the deaths of so many youth in our state to be cut short. Also at the event, Reverend Al Sharpton, attorneys Benjamin Crump and Daryl Parks, and the parents of Trayvon Martin, Jordan Davis, and Kendrick Johnson. All the black lawyers, we have to go back to our communities and we have to educate our people. The Florida is an F state. F is for Florida. Because right now, Florida is failing us. We will continue to fight. Now we will continue to stand. We are not going away. So you can see a lot of emotion at today's rally, which ended with event leaders calling people to go to their legislators to encourage change. Rockman? Thanks, Christina. You can follow the story closely.